Go ahead. Sorry. Okay. I, I wanted to ask uh, Vince a question because one of the things that we're seeing that's part of the sea change that is so critically important is employer involvement in unprecedented proportions. Uh, not simply uh, investing, you know, I'll, I'll invest a little bit of money, but really investing time and your expertise in curriculum development. And can you talk a little bit about the evolution of that and, and what the role of employers were in, in the grant process here? And why, and, and why it's in your enlightened self-interest to do so? Oh, I'll, I'll give it a try. Uh, <laughs> I guess when, when Clearwater Paper announced that they were coming to uh, Cleveland County and uh, you know, they sort of dropped a couple of us off on our own out here, um, we, we really uh, had a, a, a very uh, collaborative effort with the economic development folks and the college very early on in identifying uh, not just entry level employees, but what could we do to make those employees successful long term um, for us. And they were very interested and involved in, in our success as industry in their community. And, you know, over the last three years, we've, uh, you know, collaborated on several projects on, on both ends and had uh, tremendous results. How long has your paper company been here? Has it been over the three years? We broke ground here in uh, July of 2010. Okay. All right. So, yeah. Okay. And it's, you're continuing to grow. We are. We have uh, currently about 240 employees um, and have invested uh, $270 million. Um, and, and I love all the employees we have. Awesome. Have you gone to... Um, the Chamber of Commerce and talked about uh, your partnership with the community college at all to let other businesses know what's available here at the community college? Yes, we've been involved uh, with that group, you know, initially um, just, you know, really within days of being here, we established um, a steering committee that consisted of the, you know, ESC, the community college group, uh, the economic development folks. And, and they helped us outline a, you know, a value stream map really for the hiring process. Mm -hmm. And so along the way, that's evolved into a very uh, collaborative relationship between, between all of us. Mm -hmm. Vince is really being modest. He's, he, he really is. Um, because only having been here a few years, he's, he's a very big advocate for Cleveland County. And he actually goes on a lot of, of visits when we have economic development prospects come in, when they get to a certain point, to talk about not just the partnership with us, um, but his experience um, and the workers he has and that kind of thing. So he is um, very helpful at recruiting other industry. Oh, so good. he's not good. mentioning that, but he does that. We appreciate it. Vince, when I asked at the outset, you know, how many students are in the room, a lot of folks raised their hand. So on behalf of them, uh, what are you looking for when you're looking to hire? Because I have a feeling that uh, you're still on a, a growth uh, trajectory. We are, and, and certainly the, the programs that the college has put in place for hard skills are very important to us. Um, you know, when, when we first got here, um, we, we became involved with some different industry groups, um, you know, industrial roundtables and this kind of thing, and it, it became, uh, you know, the discussion re revolved around workforce, workforce development, availability of employees, and, and, it, was, and it was frustrating because I felt that in, in some cases, industry did a very, a very poor job of you know, taking care of themselves. And what we found at Clearwater is that there was a lot of interest and help available in the community to, to and, and, and we both had the same goal, right? We want good employees and they want to put good people to work. So it was, you know, it was a match made in heaven. Um, you know, the, the, the old days, for manufacturing when you just showed up with a shovel and you dug a hole that was, you know, X by X and, you know, if you, your employer wanted your opinion, they'd let you know what that was and, and then you'd go on from there. Um, those days are, are far behind us. Um, we want employees that are engaged, that are really business partners looking toward helping us make our, our businesses more efficient and, and competitive and, uh, you know, that's the culture that we strive to develop. And, and I think we have here.